So this is just a quick walkthrough on how to create automatically executable files for CSGO. Uh, what this is for is if you want to, say, make a key binding, but you don't want to have to continually put that key binding in every time you open up CSGO, you make an executable file so that when you open the game, it automatically puts, it automatically puts that in console for you. So what you want to do is you want to go into wherever you have Steam uh, installed, once you've opened up the Steam fi uh, file, you want to go to Steam Apps. From Steam Apps, go into Common. From Common, Counter-Strike Global Offensive. And then the CSGO folder. From there, the CFG. So once you get in here, you're going to have something that looks like this. I'm going to right-click, New, Text Document. Once you have that text document, don't worry about putting a name in it right now double click it and put in whatever files you want to automatically have load into your Counter-Strike. So I already have a bunch preset here. So what happens is when the con when I open up my game, it'll automatically change my rate to 12 1000 or 128,000 and automatically change my CMD rate to 80 and so on. And then down here is not this is binding numpad 1 to buy me a vest for first round this, I always buy a vest. This is binding keypad number two to buy me an AK or an M4 uh, with Tech 9 5 7 pistol, yada yada. You can read all that. And then right here it says Echo. And then I put in to Echo that it auto exec successfully loaded. Auto exec or auto or Echo keys binded. So what this means is when I open up console, as soon as I load up Counter Strike Sword or Counter Strike Global Offensive, this will be echoed in the console, so this is what the console will say. That's how I know that all of this has been successfully loaded. So after you've made this and you got everything you want to want it to automatically execute, file, save as. You're going to put in autoexec.cfg and change save as type to all files. That's very important. If you don't do that, it won't it won't work hit save you can close this now and right here at the top it should look like something like this or this you see how it's blank I changed mine to automatically open up with notepad so it looks like a notepad file um, but it should not look like a text document so once all that's done now we'll just load up Counter-Strike I'll open up the console and I'll show you that it worked. So you can see, oh, no, my mouse, my mouse won't work. There we go. So you can see right here, keys binded, auto successfully loaded, it's telling me that my rates were all set to where I wanted them. And if I needed to go play a quick game, show you my key bindings worked so the nice thing about doing key bindings is that now I don't need to go through the wheel in order to get a key binding all I gotta do is press or in order to buy weapons now all I gotta do is press number two and it'll buy me everything under that key binding that I can so uh, I believe I'm gonna start with a thousand bucks so it'll buy me a five to seven and a couple grenades Yeah, start with the USP, and either I could hit E or B and go through this wheel, or I could just press number two. Now it bought me a 5-7 and two grenades. Spotted the bomb carrier. So there you go, that's how you create an auto ex executable files in Counter-Strike Go. I hope that helped you. Like, subscribe, comment. If you have any questions, I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Thanks.